how to make the long speed ramp. I'm obsessive, I know things consume me. Overanalyze until my face turns blue. See what you say, what did it mean? Can you repeat it? Hey, hey, please excuse me. Today's video is sponsored by Speedy Gonzalez. Bring your clip in the timeline. Right click on it and open the retime curve. Open the retime menu, uncheck the retime frame and check the retime speed. Increase the maximum speed amount roughly around 5000. Find the frame where you want to start the speed ramp, add a keyframe, go to the frame where you want your speed ramp to end, and add another keyframe. Bring up the part between your two keyframes. Select the keyframes and change the curve to smooth. Bring an adjustment clip on top of your clip. Trim down the size to match the duration of the speed ramp. Right click on the adjustment clip and select to open it in the fusion page. Add a camera shake node. Change the border type to replicate. Increase the motion blur slider, the pan and tilt amplitude, and the speed slider. Right click in the motion scale slider and select to modify it with anim curves. Go to the modifiers tab, change the source to duration, the curve to easing, set the in and out to sign, and check the mirror box. Back to the Tools tab, right click in the Speed Scale slider, select Expression, and connect it to the Motion Scale slider. Bring a Frame Average node. Right click in the Frame slider and select to modify it with Anim Curves. Go to the Modifiers tab, change the source to Duration, the curve to Easing, set the In and Out to Sign, and check the Mirror box. Back to the Edit page, create another Speed Ramp, and duplicate your Adjustment Clip, bring it over the second Speed Ramp, and trim it down to match the size of it. If you like this clip, subscribe to this channel. If you didn't, life can be very unfair.